All right, let's do a little more of Animal Crossing. If you're watching this later on YouTube, thanks for clicking. Hope you've been enjoying so far. I need to progress a little more with this. I have stuff to sell, <laughs> first of all. But also, uh... I mean, I need to see what the requirements are. I got the feeling I need to make an incline or something. Hang on. I'm sure there's like a guide for progression. Good evening, everyone, right now. So, yep, that's the time. Okay. They'll be selling pumpkin starts. Okay. Oh, well, they were selling them in Nook's Cranny as well. Damn. Oh, well. Really appreciate you buying produce starts from me. You're such a good customer, I cooked up a recipe. Okay. Oh, it's a veggie basket. That's nice. Okay, sell and then first time be able to check out clothing. As I started too late last time. So... A no brainer. Last time. We sell fashions, yep. Oh, hey, it's a great spot find the will. Thanks for picking this fantastic location for us. We decided to put down the roots here on Shamblonia and keep selling our clothes and accessories. Let me give you a quick tour of our shop. Okay, so when you first walk in, you'll find our recommended items. We change this up every single day, just to keep things fresh. Over to the left you'll find our mannequins, they're dressed up in whatever seasonal outfits we're into. We change them from time to time, rather than daily, still hope you'll be inspired. Of course, if you see something on the mannequins you'll love, you're more than welcome to buy it. Which brings us to the back wall, where you'll find custom designs brought in by our customers. We'd love to display your designs, of course, and if you want any of these designs, they're yours. Okay. Yeah, it's tutorial. Oh. I mean, I guess I can get this.
this is what they have. I mean, not a whole lot. <laughs> I'm gonna get that for the clown. Yeah. Oh shit, that's gonna be funny. Yeah, now I look like I'm gonna... Ugh, this... Okay, let's just go with this. I'll change it. Oh, damn, it's got like a record on the back. Let's see if there's anything new. Oh yeah, there we go. sent the clothing home. Okay, I gotta go get it.
Uh, where is it? <laughs> uh, shit. Time to go deliver. I mean, you know what? It's not like what I want ultimately, but it's a good stepping stone. Daisy's up to. Yep. Sorry, I'm in the middle of something right now. What are you up to? I'm currently crafting a spooky candy set. Okay. Yes. Customize that, you'll need pumpkins of different colors. Okay. Pietro's home. Oh, wow. Come on, Conk, you came to see me. What's the latest? You know what, Champlone? really needs a special night for everyone to dress up. We could call it Pietro Night. Don't get me wrong, Champlain is already a little bit stylish, but it's not just Pietro stylish yet. Oh, you got my attention, what's up? How can I give him a present? Don't let anyone tell you. Okay. I don't want to give it. Check out my super cozy crescent moon, chair, huh? Yep, I had it custom engineered to match every curve of my body. In layman's terms, it's like a cloud hugging my butt. Hang on, how do you give a present? I swear you could do this. Yeah, how do you do it? But they've been for a couple days. Which of these is truly me? Stage hand, huh? Okay, I'm basically on Rex Wallace though, so what are you trying to say? Just teasing. It's awesome, you got great taste. I just really should... I should really be getting to know people here a little better, starting with you. Am I right or am I right? I'm right. Let's see, Well, Where should we begin? Okay. Favorite movie genre, go. Something else? Uh, 
Does this work? Let me just make sure I heard you right. You said comedy, yeah? That's alright. We should check out comedy. Done. Well, not literally. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have a movie marathon to get to. I swear he's been here more than one day. Oh, what's with the active wear today, Hong Kong? Gonna do a little mu Muay Thai? Oh, I was just asking because of what you're wearing. Get ready for adventure and you're a gym thief. So this is like a shrine to me. A shrine to myself for me. I mean... Huh. I swear he's... I swear he's been there more than a couple days. Maybe because I haven't talked to him? Wow, you're really practiced though, disrupting the old-fashioned hospitality model. I like it. It's not working. You know what, Chamblaine, it really needs a special night for everyone to dress up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, well, I'm just gonna have to keep this present on me, I guess, until I can gift him it. That's weird. I he has been on this island for long enough. Not sure why it's not letting me. It's alright. <laughs> Eventually I'll get to it. Oops. There we go. I guess. put it in storage. I can only drop it. Which I guess if I keep it in here, it's fine. I'll try it later. It's a strange limitation. Thing. I'm not sure how I'm going to deal with this side of the island. recovers the money I spent for the clothing.
Ooh. I see. I need it to be in view. Sigh of relief. He was thinking about something, but then he's no longer thinking about it anymore. That got interrupted. I'm not sure what it would have been. I don't think it would have been a move out prompt. That would have been great. Let's just watch him for a minute. I've grown wary of run-of-the-mill furniture, so I designed a DIY furniture recipe to inspire. I cannot keep this idea to myself. It's a stone wall. Oh, cool. Everyone seems to be exercising. is not quite up to phase two yet. I'm taking f the time to grow flowers. Keep an eye on him. don't want any of those trees up here. Okay. I might leave the stump just for catching bugs sake. and the stars. I don't think I've got to do it the next day. How's it going? Welcome. Oh, it's more of these. Yeah, but I'm not going to plant anymore. Three's enough. Three's enough. 
All right, we're good. I knew it was too good to be true. I thought they were going to be fossils. You don't know you could chop bamboo. Oh yeah, in spring there's special bamboo that you get. So there's some recipes that involve it. Damn it. Some of that looks nice. There's fencing you can get that looks alright. Uh, I'll do this later. I don't I don't feel like doing that right now. You can stay asleep on the beach. How many fossils do I have? Five. I need one more. Probably walk past it a bunch of times. Probably on the other side of the island. Is that a big shadow? I can never tell. my favorite thing to do in Animal Crossing. Uh, I like making my town look nice overall. It takes ages, but that's pretty much why I like playing the game. Hey. Hang on, there's a spider back there. Wait for it to come into view. I saw it. Oh, it's a beetle. Okay. <laughs> I've got a long way to go on this this island. Is this gonna grow here? can never catch scorpions. I mean, do you just keep accidentally running into them? Because that's, that's what happens to me a lot. But once you know they're there, they're not too bad to catch. You just have to be slow about it. Business. Ah, it can be tricky. You just have to try and line yourself up so it's a straight line. It's not always the easiest thing to do. Where 
Where is this lost fossil? probably walk past it. I think I know where it might be. I don't think I looked here. Kind of wing it. It's just based on whatever items I find. It makes it a little easier and harder at the same time. I have to improvise. I, oh, now I have. Okay, I miscounted. Doesn't matter. So far, the only thing I have is just a basic idea of layout and then just two security gnomes. So I don't know. I'll do something with that. I might make a security gate or something. And then I just have the town in kind of a, a grid. With the museum being on an island. That's more organized. <laughs> well, thank you for calling it organized. I have a loose plan. At the very least, this bridge will run across, and then I'll make another bridge here eventually. I just have a problem because I can't do it because of this corner thing, but I'll fix that later, once I can. And I'll just set up, like, an island museum, mini island museum. That's it. Probably have to start collecting duplicate fossils and try and put some together. All right, identify first. I have a picture in my head. It's just kind of hard to convey it without actually having something there. So I got some duplicates. Oh wow, half of them were duplicates. Well I've read most of these. Maybe not a T-Rex, what was the T-Rex thing? T-Rex is the 800 pound gorilla of the dinosaur world, but it likely weighed over 9 tons. This fearsome chap is practically synonymous with the word dinosaur, and for good reason. At up to 42 feet long with banana sized teeth, it was one of the largest carnivores ever to walk the earth. It's unclear how fast T-Rex was, since estimates vary wildly. I'm just relieved I will never have to escape one. I'll just donate the other two. 
The other two, are, I'm positive I've heard him say something about it. Okay. Let's see what I have. Mm. I'll pick a dinosaur to put up the front. Parasaur? It's kind of hard to tell what that one's going to be. This one might be interesting. That's like the club tail thing. I mean, T-Rex is the obvious choice, but right now I don't have one to spare. So I don't accidentally sell it. Okay. Wait, you can eat. You can eat a. Sh huh? I suppose it's just shoots. Just the icon looks weird. I wouldn't want to eat that. But yeah, you can eat bamboo. I might hang on to this, because I want to get a model done of it. Even though it's worth a lot of bells. I just need to catch two more. going to have a look at what new fish have arrived in October. But first, I'm going to pay off some of my home loan. Okay. Uh, new Horizon, there's a tracker. I forget where it is. That's the one. Uh, fish, and then we want October, Southern, cool. Okay. I'm gonna start using this properly, so bear with me. Okay, I have the anchovy, so that's caught and donated. I have the knife jaw, the barrel, this is something I don't have, so that's at the C. Okay, so that's one I have to get, uh, sea bass definitely got. Blue gill definitely got. Blue marlin got. Uh, 
Okay, butterfly fish is new in the ocean. Uh, I do have carp. Okay, char is new in the river cliff top. Cherry salmon, river cliff top. Uh, clownfish in the sea. Do I have a clownfish? No. Okay. Coelacanth, um, only on rainy. I don't have it. I don't have crawfish. That's in the pond. So I got a, I got a lot to do. Christian carp is acquired. Dab is done. Dace is done. Um, this one. Okay. Golden trout, definitely not done, but I have to try for it now. The goldfish I got. Guppy, don't have. Horse mackerel. I should have, yep. Uh, krillfish, don't have. Koi, I should have. Loach, I have. Neon Tetra. Do I have Neon Tetra? Damn, there's a lot of fish. Warfish, I got. Olive Flander, I got. Uh, Pale Chub, yes. Sorry, this is taking a while. Nearly done. Uh, Pop-eyed goldfish. Don't have it. Ranchu goldfish. Yes, got it. Red snapper, I definitely have. Apparently I don't have a seahorse. That's... Don't know how that's happened. Sea bass. <laughs> Gee, I wonder if I have the sea bass. Um, squid, done. Sturgeon fish, don't have. Tadpole, there it is. And I have the tuna. Okay, that's everything. Now hide donated, there we go, there's our list. So there's... 16 fish. Okay. Now I know. of getting more clothing. Do I have... Uh, even if I don't, I'll hang it up or something. I wish it would tell you. Actually, I didn't play this the next day, so I missed out on the stars. I completely forgot. I should have just turned on the switch and just got in the medias and not done anything else. 
Okay. Uh. You would think I would have gotten tired of this. Actually, hold on. I'll do the the otter thing first. Then I'll worry about fishing. Might be it already. Oh no, okay. Check the list of critters because I think I'm just going to get them naturally anyway. It's more the fish that I have to be on top of just because you need a time of day and rain and then a location. What is your advice, Stone Otter? Hey man, about that scallop of yours, can I have it? Go for it. Oh, thanks for your just generosity, man. Since you were cool, I left you something you'll dig. While I'm at it, let me lay some truth on you, the deep kind. Feel this. People ask, where does the time go? But I know, man. There's a used time store near my place. Stick that in your skillet and let it simmer. Yep, today is a good day. Okay. I'm nearly done. What did he give me anyway? A tiara. I could give that to one of the villagers. Alright, well. I'm gonna get onto fishing now. Alright, you're here. What does this even look like? <laughs> I mean... Oh, It's just a sea bass, but... I almost didn't get it. Alright, wake up. Uh, I find a single reason in these cookies. I'll kill whole the lot of ya. Uh, do you call that a sea bass? I call it a sea at best thing. Yo ho, yo ho, pirate sounds, etc. 
Ah, fuck it now. That's a bit out of me price range. Could I talk you into a discount for both ears? Such a star. This is it, mateys. We're headed for Davy Jones' shoot cubby. Ah. Ah, put your backs into it, me hearties. Haul oh, as much as you can carry. We ship out in. Ah, oh, whoops. This be no grocery run. This is the aisle of me bestest matey. How have you been, Will? As for me, while well, I took another tumble over the bow into the sea, washed up here. You know how it be. Ah, could you guess I am all well washed up? <laughs> it be mighty unkind to not give your favorite captain a courtesy laugh. Well, I'll forgive ye. The rescuing bit will be no laughing matter after all. So long as I have me trusty old communicator, I'll just... Uh... Oh my gosh. Me trusty communicator has gone and vanished. Arr. Those waves bopped me around like an inflatable beach ball. The thing must have slipped out of me pocket. That means I'm lost at sea. I'll have to wait for me buccaneer buddies to find me on their own. That could take quite a bit of time. I'm still workshopping the pirate puns, so those are sure to run out fast. I'm begging you, matey. Will you help me find me commu communicator? Jeez, I can't read. Ah, you mean that? Now there's a shanty deserving of a jig. Me gut says me communicator is in a nearby ocean. Me crew is surely searching for me, so I should keep a lookout. Guts to be on land for that, you savvy? That means it's up to ye to swim about and find me communicator. I'm counting on ye, matey. Oh, and make sure there's room in your pockets. Okay. Just consider the insanity of the request he's asking. It's bad enough to try to find something on the beach where there's a lot of sand, but we're talking about an ocean. not want to spend ages on it. Car, have you found it yet? Yar. Arr, that's it, me precious communicator. I thank you with all me heart, matey, with extra cherries on top even. Now I can contact me faithful crew. Avast you lily-livered sea dogs. Tis I, your beloved captain, who makes things happen. I had another bad spill, so ye best change course and come pick me up. Here be me coordinates. Be quick about it or I'll buckle your swashes for good. So says Captain Gulliver. Arr. Winky face, send. Ah. That ought to put some wind in their sails, and no mistake. You saved me life. That's a debt that needs repaying. So I'll ship you a fine reward soon. Expedite it. Arr. Ah, that takes a load off. Nothing left to do but wander this here beach and look mean. Here I go. Arr. <laughs> I mean, if they were real pirates, at a certain point they would kind of get sick of this. I wish I could take his, his vest and give it to the clown so then I have a clown pirate. Stop it. I, I just want to go fishing. Get out of my way. <laughs> He's in my way. Okay, 
Mods. Near. I should mark it off. Where's my fish list? Uh, clown fish. Caught. And donated. Done. What else? Seahorse apparently is around. Sturgeon fish. There's, there's a few. I already got that. Us. <laughs> reacted slowly. I still caught it. That's how you know. Oops. Hawaiian print apron. Oh. <laughs> I guess if I get like a chef hat. Oh, I need to be picking up seashells. Okay. Patient. What's the fish it wants me to catch? Christian carp, okay. Sad thing is that small shadow will probably would have been it. Five, six, seven, okay. Three more. Talk to three villagers. Not him.
what's up? I got a surprise for you. Boom, Prezi. My striped teeth. It's for my bestie, and that's you. Super fab, right? I hope you think it's so too. Enjoy. Stick to it. I'll probably wear it at some point. Okay, so the gorilla has fleas, which is a good sign. Unfortunately, I need to get one. I think that just means they've been neglected. Not, not, not now, not now. That's not what I'm here for. Okay. Oh, killifish, cool. I'll catch it just because I need one, but next time I'm not getting it. <laughs> the curse is lifted for now. Please, huh? I should have guessed as soon as I felt the itch. Anyway, good looking out. I'd have been in some itchy in for some itchy nights without you having my back, Broom. Well. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get enough miles for it. What's the hot item? Classic picture, that's clay. That's a nice and easy one. The only time, like, this is a worthy reaction. <laughs> ah, flea, what a wretched thing. The last time I've left to ask, would you like to learn more about the specimen? Yes. <laughs> ah, I see. In that case, ahem. <laughs> Allow me to be blunt. The flea is foul. It is also disgusting, repugnant, and vile. Whew, but I digress. This hard pest sucks the blood of humans and animals. In fact, it is the flea's own saliva that makes us itch. And did you know their legs are so strong they can jump more than 50 times their body length? So you see, it's all too easy for a flea to jump from you to me. I itch at the very thought. Okay. Fish. Okay. Ah, uh, the magnificent killifish. Did you know there are over 1,000 different species? My goodness, what a family tree to keep track of. My own favorite killifish species are the mangrove, which can live on land for weeks, breathing air, and the mummic hog, the first fish ever brought to space. I wonder if, killifi if the killifish you've brought me is related to either of those intrepid explorers. And there you have it. Okay. 
Clownfish. This is undoubtedly a, a clownfish. Now, might I interest you in a few fascinating facts about your clownfish? Yes. Wonderful, I would love nothing more. If you can deny the delightful qualities of the clownfish, these vibrant fish make their home among venomous anemones. It's a mutually beneficial arrangement. The clownfish finds safety in the anemone's wriggling arms as well as leftover scraps of food. In return, the clownfish ward off parasites and predators for the anemone. Thus, these colorful fish remind us of the importance of maintaining good cheer among our roommates. I need to get a clownfish for Pietro. That's going to happen. Careful not to accidentally sell the clothing. Okay. I kind of wish you could pin the items so then they don't move, but. I get it because... Oh, I missed one. Because the tools get broken. Now I'm not going to bother with the bugs, unless it's a spider. I'm going to put the clothing away and then I'm going to do more fishing. What's Alice doing over here? Oh, hello, Governor. I try to be a good listener. You can talk to me anytime, Governor. Oh, that's nice. Storage is full. Wait, even this? Okay, well, there's a simple solution to this. I need to make stuff with softwood, but also... Let me make some classic... These. Damn, I've already run out of storage. Okay. This is good. Sell a few of these, make a bunch of money. <laughs> Just wish I could craft all of them at once. One day we'll get it. Not in this game, but in some other game. And they'll make it sound like a massive feature. Introducing multiple crafting. Now you can craft all your favorite items without having to go through the process multiple times. Uh, 
available with the new Animal Crossing DLC. Yeah, it probably won't be something that's in the new game outright. But of course it's free if you have a Nintendo Switch Expansion Pass Deluxe Package with gold membership. I think eventually that service will be worth it, it's just right now, I don't know. Cancelling a lot of online stuff. PlayStation got the axe because it just costs too much now for what I use it for. I'm just waiting for Netflix to do one more thing and then I'll probably cut that as well. I don't know. I feel like we've gone worse now. It was convenient before, but now it's just, oh, you have to own six streaming services to be able to watch what you want. It's almost worse than cable. I'll see what else I can make to cut down storage. Maybe some softwood stuff. I seem to have a lot of it. Okay, uh, what else have I got? Yeah, I have way too much softwood, so what can I make? Just to free up a little space. Oh, it's wooden block stuff, I mean. Something that would just take a lot off. I don't think I have- I don't think I have anything. The problem with making the wooden toy is just- well, I'm just gonna end up with wooden toys. Hang on, let me go all. Yeah, it, it doesn't add up. <laughs> I'm just gonna make more things. Uh, That's, yeah, only three. I needed to eat, like, seven at least. Yeah, I can't do anything about it. Um, and even the softwood stuff just seems to be mixed with normal wood. I guess I just have to hope that the toy block becomes like a hot item one day. Alright. <laughs> I'm gonna see how much this gets me.
Okay. I might make more of them. Wait, I still need three more shells? One, two, three. There we go. <laughs> oh boy, more crafting. All right, uh... I don't necessarily think this is a bad thing. Alright. Just, I'm feeling the repeat of when I had to try and catch that fish. I crafted just about 200 pieces of bait. Not all at once, just like took it 50 at a time. I still can't believe I caught the fish with probably 40 seconds to spare. What's that sound? It's, it's the clock. It's a mix of the, uh, the wall clock and the outside clock. But it should give me good money. Uh, let me see if there's anything else I can get rid of. I mean, some of these rugs I got just to get the Sahara thing done.
Maybe some of these... Just get rid of two more of these. Because you can get those anytime. It's not a big deal. Sent. I'm stockpiling miles. Uh, buy items. Okay. That's what I was waiting for. See if there's a single item that I can... That'll do it. Okay. One of them is water plants, I'll just water the ones outside. Is it water produce? It might be water produce. Which, either way... No? What is it? Oh no, it's ten to flowers. It's eight. I thought it was only three for some reason. Then just do this again. Oh no, there is a tent to produce one. Okay. Then I was right. We have so many buttons on the controller, and yet, games insist on just... Interact and pick up with the same button. Or use, use and interact, sorry, and then... Pick up and pick up item, I don't know. I feel like there should be a separate harvest button. Eight buttons on the controller without including plus or minus and the D-pad. Oh, hold on. Fish, please! It's nothing. <laughs> I already knew. The moment the controller didn't vibrate.
Getting there. That's new. Also new. Go home. I forgot to mark off the fish off the fish list. Uh, crawfish, done. And turkey fish, done. Okay, so ocean wise, seahorse, sturgeon fish, barrel eye, which isn't until way later. There's sturgeon fish, okay. Barrelai is in another hour. Hey. <laughs> what am I doing? Why is it being weird? There we go. I don't think there's anything I can get on the river, unless it's on the cliffs. Like, this is just gonna be this. So I guess I'll have to collect a bunch of bait again. Gonna work. No. At least that fish is worth something.
Oh. Nein, zwei. Das ist kein Awkward. Hey, there it is. Okay, so that just leaves butterfly fish. Coelacanth is the only one that's raining. Barrel eyes in an hour. Trying my best not to miss anything. Like, what's what's my chain at now? It's at twenty nine. Damn. Okay. This is probably the closest I've gotten it to fifty. I guess the way I could almost guarantee it is just go for small fish now. Or just the shadows that are obviously sea bass. I don't think I'm wearing socks, so I'll take those. Oh, small fish. probably stop counting. I might jinx myself. I'll go donate. Alright, let's find out about it. Ah, a favorite of mine to be sure. The seahorse is a very unique creature and is indeed a fish. 
Though as far as fish go, seahorses are not great swimmers. The seahorse you see has but a wee fin on its back, which propels it through the water, but rather poorly. Thus, these fish are often found using their prehensile tails to hold tight in amongst the seagrass. And here's one final factor. You see horses have no stomach, and so must constantly feed to stay alive. Oh. Indeed, the life of a land horse sounds far easier than that of the hard-working horse of the sea. This is a crawfish. Yes, learn about it. So you have found a crawfish, neither crab nor lobster. Crawfish evolved in an interesting manner. Beware their fearsome pinchy pincers. Behold their many legs, I say. It is a bit bug-like, oh uh, what? The more I look at it, the more unsettled I feel. Let's be done with this and never speak of it again, shall we? Okay. I was about to assess a fossil, I don't know why. Sturgeon fish. Oh, woohoo, this is undoubtedly a surgeon fish. Okay. Careful now, these fish are particularly dangerous despite their seemingly docile appearance. With its saturated blue and yellow tones, the surgeon fish is quite breathtaking. It's got to keep up with all the other vibrant fish that live in the coral too, I wager. Quite the competition. Its spine is sharp as a blade, so care must be taken when handling these beauties. Oh. The turkey fish. The sheer brilliance and diversity found in the aquatic underworld never ceases to amaze me. This zebra turkey fish is as stunning to gaze upon as it is deadly. Those spines that are part of its defining physique are chock full of venom. Fortunately, zebra turkey fish are not susceptible to another's venom. Though solitari solitary, geez, solitary, I was trying to say solidarity. Though solitary, I imagine they give one another a mean fin bump when passing each other by. That's why the sentence was about solidarity. And there you have it. Fascinating stuff, no? Okay. Later, maybe. Because museums sometimes have science exhibits. I could do like an outside sciencey thing. Maybe. I believe that is the technical term, sciencey thing. Okay, but I'm causing- I'm just, like, gonna run out of room again. Maybe I should just work towards paying off the loan, so then that should expand storage again. Thank you. 
Is outside. Hang on. <laughs> I'm gonna try and gift them the thing. Let's see if it works. I don't care that it was a big fish, though. It's probably nothing major. I guess you must have splurged for the all-access pass, huh, Pietro Unlimited? Ugh, still doesn't let me gift them. Is that one of those vaulting poles I've been hearing about? Ugh, I want one of those so much. I don't care about vaulting. I just want to have the latest cool thing. I'm gonna end up with either a gangster clown or a pirate clown, one or the other. I'll put cannon. If I'm kind of hoping pirate clown, because then I can put maybe cannonballs or something <laughs> outside his house. I'll have my own buggy, the clown. All oh, right, fishing pole. Uh, I can still make one. One more. Good rod. And like, where are the customization kits? I should probably customize. The slingshot and the net, since I've been using them. Plus, I need to customize two items anyway. Sure.
stink bug. Uh, okay. I do the exercise thing, but I'm just lazy. Which is pretty fitting. Okay, well all I have to do is just catch this butterfly fish, and then I guess I'll head to the cliff top. be getting close to the 50. There it is. Okay. I got to be like a couple away, surely. But it says 20. Oh no, that was my last record. So I don't know how many I'm out now. Uh... I mean, I feel like I'd be close. But maybe I'm underestimating just how much 50 is. Probably better that, that I don't know. So now it's just, well, if it happens, if it happens. I don't know if I'm going to gift that to someone. sound of letting me know. The butterfly fish is just charming with its beautiful colors and elegant movements. I refer to it as a butterfly fish, but it's actually a grouping 
in which there are over 100 types. These beautiful aquatic friends swim in schools amid coral fluttering back and forth with the tides. The sheer awe one must experience when witness witnessing such a sight. It must be a dream. So much better than actual bladderflies. Alright. Was a rockfish. I may as well sell on here. There's only twenty five minutes until the shop closes anyway. I'll sell it. It's unlikely that I'm going to use it. Plus, I don't exactly have storage space right now. Hear another balloon, or am I, am I going crazy? I might be going crazy. <laughs> it might just be the tide. Well, I mean, I guess how confident am I that I'm close to 50 fish? Either way, boring process begins now. Bill got interrupted earlier. I kind of want you to move out because you were sort of forced upon this this town just because of the campsite thing.
Where are the manila clams? <laughs> there we go. Oh, no. Good job. I swear, the moment I start looking for something, it just disappears. Okay, so here's how I'm gonna play it. Anytime I see a little fish, I'm gonna catch it. Whilst I'm gathering bait. And then hopefully I can get to the 50 in a row that way. Because little fish let you react quick enough. There's, there's wiggle room. And then I'll know for sure how many fish are left. I mean, even these are fine. Just nothing big. I'm pretty sure that's how I had to do it the first time around. See, I, react, I reacted slowly, but it still worked. <laughs> this is why. If that would have been a larger fish, that would have broken the chain. Okay, there's another little one. have to be patient. I think it's better just to split up the craft and so I don't lose my mind. That's it, right? Yeah. 
Okay. Back to bait gathering. A small fish. I would hope that I'm like at about 40 or so now. I just wish there was some way to know. What's that? Yep, yeah, not small one. what I did last time. I'll gather like 50 pace pieces. Paces? Pieces. Pieces. And then hopefully that'll be enough what I need to get from the cliffs. Where is, where is it? I'm just disappointed in it because I got rid of a lot of clay before to make room. Hello, MCS. Welcome. How's it going? Okay, I can breathe. I'd be close to 50 now. Oh. Well. Make sure I still have enough time to sell before the shop closes. 
Guess I may as well. Alright. <laughs> Sorry, this is going to be life as we know it for at least the next 15 20 minutes whilst I get all the bait, and then I can go to the cliffs and fish. One day we'll be able to craft multiple items. Twenty-nine. <laughs> Jeez. I thought I had more. Uh, well, it's not risky to catch. bother with it. I'm just gonna stick to little fish until I know. Or mess up, whichever happens first. Oh, hang on. There is a way to know. I'll know once I've gone past. Yeah, so we're at 38. Ha ha! There we go. Okay, now I know. So I need to catch 12 more without messing up.
This is such an annoying challenge. <laughs> Size is that? That's too big. Turn around, fish. Over here. Nothing. Is that nine now? and sell because there's five minutes left. Almost out of clothing room now. I have four minutes, so I need to hurry up. I'm out of storage, aren't I? Oh, wait, that's gonna sell. Uh, okay. I can't remember what a shovel's made out of. You would think at this point I would have it memorized. It is not. What is a shovel? Hardwood, damn it. Two minutes. I'm worried if I talk to Alice, she'll want to move out. Let's just not... not talk to anyone that has that bubble today. Okay. 
All right, well, that's all I can do money-wise. Okay. Just refresh it. Don't tell me it didn't save my list. Well, it's okay. Barrel Ice should be available. Another balloon. Yeah. <laughs> Loft bed with dust. Oh, yeah, yeah. I know what that is. Ah, oh, damn it, it's not a fish. It doesn't count, I don't think, towards the total. Wait, maybe it did. No, it didn't. <laughs> uh, how many more? Seven.
Äh. So. myself problems. <laughs> Just stick to the plan. Why does it do that sometimes? Character fully spun around. to 50 and then it's at least a milestone I just worry that I won't get the 50 Happens after 50, I'm happy either way. It'd be great to get to 100, but I wouldn't be able to get any other fish until then. What do you want? I've got something new to add to your reactions game. Let's say love is about to give you high five, and then it pulls its hands back through its hair. Happened to me, so it could happen to you. So, what do you do? You hit him with one of these. Trust me, heartbreak is the tried and true way to communicate emotional agony in a pinch. Is this just preempting that I'm not gonna get to 50? Looks like a fairly big shadow. Okay. Well. That's good. I'm. Like, just let me get to 50, then I'll go for that. Provided it doesn't vanish.
good. Just keep the small fish coming. Surely that's 50. Oh, that's bad timing. That is 50. Okay. Oh, no, that's trash tools. It's 50, but different kind of 50. Okay, no, it is 50. There we go. <laughs> that should be worth way more. It's more of an effort to get to 50 than what they make it out to be. Thankfully, had the foresight to put one of these next to the dock. Okay, so even if I mess up, at least I got my... my 50. Alright, I got to 50. I knew that was gonna happen. It was probably just a sea bass and I got faked out. I think the fishing challenge is no problem if you don't go for the big ones. The big ones just cause too much stress. Okay, uh... That would probably be the last piece of storage I have. Oh, apparently the barrel eye is a small a shadow. Shadow size, shadow, shadow size two. Jeez. <laughs> My ability to talk just goes out the window the closer it gets to midnight. Since ocean fishing isn't a pain, I'm going river fishing. Hang on. I also... <laughs> because I need bells, I'll sell these tomorrow. Not that. Thank you. 
Sure. <laughs> it's a little messy. Alright. Is that another balloon? Yep. Wait for it. Since I need to cut down a tree, and this one's kind of in my way. Where you go. Pick it up, not sit down. Okay. Well, I mean, this counts as a river. Let's see what luck I have. Okay. It's a char. Catch everything. <laughs> I didn't know I could do that. Go down the waterfall like that. I know the likelihood of getting the golden one is very low.
At least if I don't mess up, I'll be back up to 38 in a row. It sucks, because if I didn't miss that one, I would be up to the end. Oh, cool. Cherry salmon. Alright. The only one missing is the golden one, which unlikely, but at least I got that now. I'll be really happy if I get this, because the first time... Jeez, I think it took multiple nights of fishing to do it, to find it. It wasn't just me, people helping as well. Cherry salmon. Yahoo! All right, we're pretty much done here. Oh, that's a big shadow. I reacted slightly, so I know it's not good. If there was something good, it would have not gotten caught. Oh, well, that's not happening. Here, another balloon. Okay, one sec. Just gonna. I mean, to have one less spell now. I oh, know, okay.
Oh, that was something good. I reacted too slowly. Damn it. Well, probably won't get anything else now. <laughs> Unless I got lucky enough to find that shadow again. I got two other fish to donate. I think the problem with this one's gonna be if I have to do this at night, ugh. Cherry salmon is related to the salmon and is known for its distinctive pattern of polka dots. These polka dots disappear as they mature, but only in the fish of certain geographic area. Pity the poor researchers that must make sense of the cherry salmon's fickle fashion sense. This is a char. Alright, tell me about the char. The char is one of the bigger fish around, and in the world of fish, that's quite an accomplishment. They are territorial predators, and therefore must constantly defend their turf from others. So when you see a large char like this one, it is likely a skilled fighter and veteran of many battles. My feathers, I hope it never has cause to go to battle with me. Okay. No. I have two more fish down. Only gathering bait wasn't just such a massive process. I'd be like, alright, go for another round. It takes ages to gather and it takes ages to craft. to move customization kits over. Not that.
just some of the stuff that I know I've used. I think even the watering can could use one as well. That's just so I don't have them break on me tomorrow. Oh. Well, that's, that's that problem. Um. Yeah, that's probably the easiest solution. Why not? Two more. Who knows, I might get lucky. Bothered. Just okay. It's another little, little one. I kind of deserve that for being impatient. That's what I get. Nah, I'm not gonna bother. It's just a small one. Let's see if there's anything. Oh, hello. I think this can't be what I think it is, but let's just go for it anyway. Yeah, it's just ordinary fish. I saw it. Game going crazy with the balloons. Nice. Something just occurred to me as well. Might as well grab some of these, so then they're in my inventory ready to sell. Okay. Cool. That's a solid three hours. <laughs> I got some of the stuff I was after. I think I just need to make more of an effort to get the stuff on the cliff. Okay. Well. That'll do it for Animal Crossing for today. But I'm not done with the stream just yet. But anyway, if you've reached the end here. Watching later on YouTube. Thanks for sticking around to the end. And hope you enjoyed. And if you want to support the channel. Easiest way to do so is just click one of those buttons. Particularly the ones that have a thumbs up on them. Helps out a lot. And in the meantime, if you want to watch me play something else, two other videos have probably popped up by now, so hope you check them out. Till next time, bye YouTube.